Oh, my name is Joyce Gibson, and I'm broker owner of J.A. Gibson Realty, but I'm also the president of the uh, Dearborn Realtors Board, which is the oldest and largest African-American real estate trade association in the state of Illinois. In, in addition to the real estate work that I'm doing, I, I belong to a lot of different organizations, and one that we started, uh, it's called Malachi CDC, and a program that we're doing that's called the Gateway Project. Mm -hmm. And that is uh, working with, uh, in tandem with uh, McCaffrey Interest, who are the developers of the U.S. Steel uh, site, and hopefully to stabilize South Shore and South Chicago uh, communities through uh, putting these houses that have been abandoned back on the the market and getting them sold to people who want to make a 30-year investment into this area. Mm -hmm. and so we started Gateway basically with calling together all of the real estate brokers in the area, all of the banks, and we talked with the developer and told them what our vision was and what we would like to see happen, that we want to stabilize the Gateway community mm -hmm. to this new project. Um, and the Gateway Corridor, 79th Street, 71st, 75th, 83rd, 87th, all of those gateway streets that lead to that project, we want to talk about let's develop them for business, let's talk about bringing people in, let's make this attractive that people can come in and buy and begin to change their community. Mm -hmm. And so far uh, we have We've been doing a lot of tours this year. We've had a lot of, we've done a lot of presentations at church, uh, 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 with church groups. Mm -hmm. um, and it's interesting because a lot of the um, information that they have is wrong information. They have no idea how much these houses are. You know, when we're telling them, we give them a list of houses that are currently available for $30,000, $40,000. You can get a 203K and you can renovate this house. You can buy a house for 80000 and it doesn't need renovation, but you like a new kitchen. You can still do that. And we're going to go to the next phase where we're going to have, we're looking at blocks. That's part of our strategy is to identify blocks where there are abandoned houses and then focus on trying to get those blocks sold mm -hmm. and getting the word out. We're looking uh, to try to put those homes into the hands of people who want to live in the area, not just people looking to speculate and investors that are coming in to just hold it. And we, We're looking for people that really want to make an investment and make South Shore and South Chicago their home. I, I'm really excited about uh, the fact that there's going to be in phase one uh, shopping mm -hmm. and all of the things that I have to travel outside of my community for. Mm -hmm. um, I live on South Shore Drive, but if I want to go to a decent restaurant, I have to go, like yesterday I was downtown. Because a lot of businesses don't want to come, they, you know, they excite, oh, I don't want to come south because of the crime, or I can't come south, oh, there's a lot of unemployment and the median income is this, and the, but we are consumers here. Because I think that if you're stuck in the old economic paradigm that says, you know, we do best in areas that have a median income of this, you know, I think we're a little bit past that now. I really do. I think more of an indicator about where you would place a location is not looking at the whole area and say, okay, this is the median income for that area, is to basically look and say, where are my people coming from that are buying my goods and services? Mm -hmm. I remember when they opened Garrett's Popcorn, it was right before Christmas, and I had a friend call me and said, you know, they're opening the Garrett's Popcorn on uh, right off of Cottage Grove. And I said, really? And she said, yeah. I said, oh, that's great, because I love Garrett's popcorn. I would drive downtown on Sunday to get Garrett's popcorn, okay? I said, oh, that's wonderful. So I said, I'm gonna run over there. Well, yeah, that was December. I haven't been able to get in there yet because there is always a line at Garrett's popcorn. You know, when people understand that we are consumers here, we will spend our money on where, if we perceive it to be something that we buy, it has value, it has, we're there. You know, the biggest thing I hear from the community is, oh, we're going to be displaced. Mm -hmm. um, oh, they're going to move us out. We're going to be displaced. And when I say to people, people get displaced of ignorance because they don't know what's happening. Mm -hmm. They have no idea what's going on. The planning's going on all around them, and they just sit there like, oh, everything's going to stay the same. When you have the information and you know mm -hmm. what the future is, going to be and what it's going to look like, then you have the opportunity to participate in it. Mm -hmm. If people are waiting for something from the outside to come in and make a change, mm -hmm. 
it has to start from within. It has to be the community saying, you know, this is what we want. Mm -hmm. That when people understand, you know, you're bringing housing in, and not just transient housing, people are making an investment, those are the kinds of things that have sustainable revenue base. We're taxpayers, we live here, we have a voice here. Well, this is the kinds of things that we want to see in our community. And I think when we start stabilizing that, that's when we begin to change what the face of South Shore and South Chicago are going to look like. Mm -hmm. I would tell a young couple, you know, you look for a community where you can grow, mm -hmm. where you can raise your kids, um, where there's opportunities. I, I think that if people get to know this area, they'll get to love this area. That if somebody's looking to say, where can I put down some roots? where I can really plant myself and grow, mm -hmm. then you're looking at the southeast side of Chicago, the communities of South Shore and South Chicago. Mm -hmm.